Welcome to RunAllGodsChildren.com, where Jesus is the teacher. O oh, Grandfather God, in the name of thy Son, Father, Lord, God, Jesus Christ Almighty, Jealousy. I pray unto both of you to have mercy upon all the children's souls, for they do not believe that you are the grandfather God, or your son is the father God, the creator of all things. I pray unto both of you, have mercy upon all thy children's souls. This time has come for you to get this world, for no one believes. Oh, Jesus, in thy name of Jesus, I report to everybody the books that I receive to share with everyone, to him that overcometh. Revelation, the third chapter, the 21st verse. He that overcometh will I grant to sit with me in my throne, even as I also overcame and am set down with my father in his throne. This is what will happen. The world will know him that will overcome him. This is the last time. Do Lord God's Father Jesus Christ's children know Father Jesus Christ is the true and living word? Something to think about. What is overcoming? What do one has to do to overcome it. It is also written, Revelation, the 21st chapter, the 7th verse, He that overcometh shall inherit all things, and I will be his God, and he shall be my son. Everyone will know he that will overcome it. For he that overcometh will tell the seven churches, which are the cities, what is written? Read for yourself. No one wants to be Father Jesus Christ's children. But who believe Jesus Christ, creator of everything? Ephesians, the third chapter, the ninth verse. If them that is head of Father Lord God's house read to you and say it is the truth, you would believe them. Up until now, I will testify to Grandfather God and Father Lord God Jesus Christ. No one believe Grandfather God is grand or Father, Lord, Jesus Christ is Lord God, creator of all things. No, not one believe. St. John, the 16th chapter, the 14th and the 15th verse. He shall glorify me, for he shall receive a mind and shall show it unto you. All things that the Father have are mine. Therefore said I that he shall take a mine and shall show it unto you. This right here, the book, is what I received because I called on the Lord to share with you. Do you believe this? The one that will overcome shall glorify Lord God 
and what he shall receive, he shall show it unto you. Who believe Lord God's word? Do them head of God's house read to you? How to know the one that will overcome it or the one that shall will glorify Lord God Jesus? What he's going to do. I am running in the race for the prize in the holy book. Are you running in the race? I ask questions about what is written. No one person answered. Oh, but Mike. Mike with his nasty self. Talk like most of Lord God's children. Judging. A friend of mine said, don't you think you are blaspheming God? Only thing I can show you is the book, the holy book I received. St. John, the 14th chapter, the 26th verse. But the comforter, which is the Holy Ghost, whom the Father will send in my name, he shall teach you all things, and all things to your remembrance, and bring all things into your remembrance, whatsoever I said unto you. Do you think, Lord God, is lying? Edification is why I'm writing and reading Lord God's word. Read for yourself. This is the beginning of the end. Let's see if I'm lying. Why no one is taught to fear Lord God? You know everyone will have wisdom. Fear is the beginning of wisdom. Who will not fear our Lord God? God, you, St. John, the third chapter, the 33rd verse, he that received his testimony have set to his seal that God is true. I only take 15 minutes to talk to you, to see who believe that God is true. His word is true. He said he has sent someone. But none of y'all believed it. Now this is the last time. This year things will happen that you will understand because you will know God is doing it. Everybody likes to joke and laugh and give charity. Oh, I give charity. I'm going to be saved. Oh, I believe in Jesus Christ. I'm going to be saved. But they don't tell you it's more to just believing. It's showing. It's knowing. It's doing the things that Lord God delights. Do you know what Lord God delights? I read it to you. Learn of him. Don't take my word. I'm not trying to tell you to, to take my word. The only thing I'm doing is telling the truth because I want to get out of here. I want to be free. I received the holy book. This book that I put on the front cover of what was published to the seven churches. But do you think they agree or read or got in touch with me? I'm a Mason. As you see, I put the yoke around my neck so I can remember what God's word mean to me. Might not mean nothing to you. You might even say, well, I'm an atheist. 
Oh, I believe that there's a God. But if you believe there's a God, wouldn't you try to learn about him? You go to God's house all the time, a lot of people. But no one learned about God. If you did, you would say Jesus created everything. I read it to you. It's written. And isn't the grandfather God grand? He gave his only begotten son that came here and you destroyed him. You thought, but he got up. A friend of mine said, you know, you you seem like you're telling all the people that's head of God's house that they are lying. Only thing I'm saying is what is written. Maybe next week I'll read to you what God said to them that is head of his house. He told them, my house shall be called a house of prayer. But you go to Saint this, Saint that. You go to uh, Emmanuel this, Emmanuel that. Nowhere have I seen or been that has in front of God's house, the house of prayer. They got their name, old oh, reverend this, or priest this, or that. And then a lot of people say, why don't you come on to my church? You know, it's not the priest's church. It's God's house. And if you really want to know God's house, look in the mirror. Because each and every one of us is God's house. But oh, no, you don't believe that. But I'm here to do one thing. And that is to tell the truth. The truth will make me free. And the truth is Jesus. Jesus is the truth. Jesus is the light. Jesus is the author, the finisher. Jesus Christ is the Lord. But who believe it? Nobody want to write to me and say, well, I believe it, or quote from the holy book like I'm doing. I'm not telling you to believe what I'm saying. But I am asking you to read for yourself. Because Jesus is everything. Jesus coming back for you and me. He's creating everything new for me and you. We will walk down the street of gold. They shine like crystal and look like glass. Jesus Christ, he's coming back. He's the one that wept and prayed for you and me. And look, look. Look at what I received. The true and living word was given to me to share with everybody. This is the last time the truth will be told. To every kinder, every tongue, and people and nation, the truth is the light that's shining you and me. He's coming back again. He's going to make us free. Jesus, 
I set to my seal that God is true. Jesus is the truth and the light that shine in everybody. He can show you better than we can read. Welcome again to runallgodschildren.com where Jesus is the teacher. I'll see you in two weeks from now. Thank you for coming.